morning storage unit. Good morning everybody watching. It is Monday morning. I hope you guys had a great weekend. I'm going to pull some sales and show you guys what sold this weekend. Some stuff is at the house obviously. As most of you guys know, but let's get started. I already see these, so I'm just going to pull them real quick. This was a really recent pickup. These Adidas VL Quartz. I didn't even have to clean these except with a magic eraser for about 15 seconds. And I sold those for full price on Poshmark for $45. We will stick with the shoes. And they are down here. Because I've had these for a while and they're big. These are Nike Revolution 2s, size 15 sold these on Poshmark for $39. Right here, I just picked these up recently too. I don't even think I've had these for a week. And I sold these Polo Ranger boots for $35 plus shipping on eBay. I will move all those shoes onto the rack once I get some extra time. All right, this should be an Eddie Bauer women's puffer jacket. Eddie Bauer, I sold this for $30 free shipping on eBay. And actually this was kind of cool. If you follow me on Instagram, I sent out some offers over the weekend and that was one of the ones that I sent offers to watchers and they actually bought it. So really happy with that sale. I actually got to bring this home right here. This Levi's Sherpa jacket right here, the two horse brand, it's like Sherpa lined. Someone asked for measurements and I have it listed for $79.99. So I'm gonna come go home and take the measurements I've had. All right, here's a bin of stuff from a auction that I got in a lot with like 700 pieces of clothing when I first started reselling. And some of this stuff is just like the cheap, cheap stuff that I didn't even list originally. And then I went back and listed it and I sold these American Eagle jeans. Uh, they're like women's flex jeans on eBay for like $13.50. <coughs> there it is. See if I can get this open with one hand. This is a 1983 Chevy Blazer Sheriff van with the antenna, pretty cool. And uh, I got these, obviously I paid $45 for all these cars plus a ton more. And I've been slowly selling them since I started reselling. So, I mean, we're in the profit, but I sold this one for $5.99 plus shipping. All right, let me move this out of the way because I sold this. It was a pretty cool sale over the weekend. Let me spread this out real quick. I picked this up at the bins and I was a little hesitant because of how small it was. And it says, I believe it says large, or medium. And this is a really tiny jacket, but it's super cool. It's all leather and it's Wilda brand, Wilda. I don't know, but it said USA on the back. And I sold this for $50 plus shipping. Alright, that's it for storage unit sales for now. Obviously, as of right now, my business has become a lot of clothing sales just because I love the bins. Like I said, my clothing sales is a majority of my business now. Uh, so most of my clothing is at my house. So we're gonna go pull those sales. And then I might hit the bins today if I get everything that I need to get done, done, which I'm pretty excited about because I've been holding off and I haven't been to the bins in about a week. I've kind of thrifted and sourced in a couple of other areas. 
So let's get back to the house and ship out the rest of the stuff. I'll show it to you guys and that'll be it. All right, babe. Hey, you got a decision to make. Hold on, let me close the door. I got an offer on Poshmark for these Birkenstocks. And I know you've been wearing them, but you told me that I could sell them. So I listed them for 40 and I got an offer for 35. Should I accept? That's a pretty good offer for a pair of sandals we paid yeah. five bucks for. I'll find more. <laughs> Sold! Made a sale while I was picking other sales. That's pretty good. We'll find you another pair. These ones are actually a little tattered up right here. So we'll find Danny some nicer ones. All right, sold. <laughs> okay, I actually had a couple of other sales that I picked up at the storage unit that I forgot about already. So I'm gonna grab these real quick out of my other car. Don't mind the mess. But I sold this F1 Championship PlayStation 2 game. I picked these up. I got like 10 of them for like a couple bucks for all of them. I sold this one for like $4 free shipping. And then I got two leather ties. I bought like 300 or 400 ties from the bins a while ago. If you guys saw that on uh, Instagram, if you've been following me for a while, at Drew underscore thrifts and flips. And I paid 19 cents for each tie at the bins average price. And I sold both of these in a lot for $19.99. Here's a couple more that I sold. I sold this lot bundle of Florida Gators basketball shorts and shirt on Poshmark. I accepted a best offer of, I think, $25, and uh, I had it listed for $30. So both of these I picked up at the bins, so I probably got about 2 bucks into that lot, so not a bad sale. I sold this Disney uh, Jungle Book shirt. It's a size 2XL. I accepted a best offer of $17 plus shipping. I sold this Love Pink Victoria's Secret zip-up jacket. Again, picked up at the bins, and I gotta check on the price, but I believe I accepted an offer on that for $20. And then right here, a Walt Disney Imagineering Polo. This is uh, actually a really cool shirt, and I sold that for $19.99 plus shipping on eBay. All right. As you can see, I've got a little bit more organizing to do, but I gotta get some more bins because I'm running out of space. So I'm using laundry baskets. But while I'm going through my sales, I just made another sale on Poshmark. I sold this Nike fleece pullover sweater. I accepted a best offer on Poshmark for $15. I had it listed for 20. So not bad. Okay, after playing a little bit of Tetris in my office here, obviously I don't have that much space. Coming into my extra large bin here. I sold this vintage Guess denim jean jacket. This was a really cool find at the bins. And this probably weighs a little over two pounds, so I probably paid somewhere around five bucks for it. My guess, some four or five bucks, and I sold it for fifty dollars plus shipping on eBay. Alright, I also forgot to mention I sold this North Face jacket right here. It's a nice hoodie and I had it on eBay for a really long time. Didn't get any hits and this was one of those items that was sitting in a bin for a while that I actually cross posted or I decided to cross post a bunch of stuff over to Poshmark. I've been slowly doing it with all my auction stuff and this was one of those items and I sold it this weekend on Poshmark for $26. So that's a really good sale. Oh, there's Danny. Uh, okay, that's it for the sales, so now we're going to go ahead and pack and ship them, and uh, I'll show you guys the stack of what we do, and normally our mailman will pick them up. If we have a lot, we'll take it to the post office, so we'll see what our stack looks like today, and hopefully our mailman, mailman will pick them up, and lucky for Danny, we get to use our new label maker. If you guys didn't see that as well, we got the Rollo, Rollo, sorry, not Rollo, Rollo, label maker printer it's going to make our lives so much easier when we're shipping products we don't have to cut print paste stamp tape 
all that kind of stuff. We just peel and slap it on the package. So anyway, I will show you guys what everything looks like when we get done packing it up.